Hello, my name is Michael Bauer and I am a knife maker. I got into knife making about 10 years ago and my particular style is a cross between traditional knife making, silver smithing and jewelry, and stained glass, which is a technique that my father taught me because that was his passion. So as you can tell, these are not your ordinary knives. When I make a knife, I decorate it with gemstones, crystals, silver, copper, and uh, many other things that I can find throughout nature. And the thing that makes me so passionate about this is the challenge. I will very often go to a state, uh, a country, a particular mountain, um, and find materials, and then use all those materials in a particular knife giving myself the challenge, can I capture the essence of this land, of this uh, mountain range, of this beach, within this particular knife? For example, this knife here was made from materials found in upstate New York. This knife was made from things that I either bought or found on the beach in Florida. You can see the shells and the shark teeth. And this knife was made from sea glass that I found in Northern California. And for me, basically, it's all about, um, you know, Okay, so I'm on a hike and I see this, you know, beautiful vista in front of me and it makes me want to do something. It makes me want to make something to respond to that. And I remember I was going through uh, a difficult time in my life and, um, you know, I would spend a lot of time in nature, hiking, going to the beach and then, um, you know, different trails, different mountains, beaches would become uh, very special to me. And I thought, what if I could make something, some tangible thing uh, that would just capture this beach or that trail or that forest um, and uh, something that could always reflect it back to me and I thought that might be very special and I might want that and I thought that if I wanted that maybe other people might want that too. Why knives? I don't know. So I start out with this. This is called a knife blank. It's basically a knife shaped piece of metal and I'm going to chop it down to the desired length and I'm going to sharpen it to how I want. Okay, next I'm going to take a look at some stones. I have this piece of petrified wood that I got um, and I'm going to polish it down. I got that from North Dakota because I think it's going to go really great with these antlers that I also got in North Dakota. This is a piece of fluorite actually that I found in a parking lot in the Badlands. We're gonna add it here to this knife using copper because silver only bonds to copper. You can't apply it directly to uh, the metal. So see how I've kind of made this copper housing for the gemstone, uh, which is a technique that a lot of stained glass uh, artists use that I learned from my father, who was a stained glass artist himself, so I'm gonna melt the silver onto a soldering iron and paint it on as if it were a silver paintbrush. So thanks again for coming out here and taking a look at some of the stuff that I make. My name is Mike Bauer and I am a knife maker in Southern California.